Canada, a country known for its beautiful nature and diverse culture, there is a positive change happening. Islam is becoming more popular, showing that Canada welcomes diversity and wants everyone to be included. Recent numbers show more Muslims in Canada and new mosques are being built. Alhamdulillah. This growth of the Muslim population is something to be positive about and brings hope for Canada's future. While Christianity is deeply ingrained in Canadian traditions and daily life, Islam holds a respectable position as the second largest religion in the country. A recent survey by Statistics Canada revealed that Islam is the religion growing the quickest in Canada. The survey looked at how religious people are, and the results showed that since 1996, the number of Muslims in Canada has increased five times, going from 1.1% to 5%. Back in 1871, only 13 European Muslims were found in the Canadian census. The first mosque in Canada was built in Edmonton in 1938 when there were around 700 European Muslims in the whole country. This mosque, now part of the museum at Fort Edmonton Park, holds the history of the early Muslim community in Canada. It's interesting to note that in 1985, there were so few Muslims that they were just grouped under other and federal surveys. And way back in 1944, there were so few Muslims that Muslim wasn't even included in the census. Things changed in the early 2000s when more Muslims started coming to Canada after they removed preferences for European immigration. In 2001, there were over 579,000 Muslims and estimates for the 2006 census pointed to around 800,000 as of May 2013. Muslims made up 3.2% of the total population, totaling over a million, making Islam the fastest growing religion in Canada. Latest statistics indicate that there are over 2 million Muslims in Canada. In the greater Toronto area, about 9.9% .9 of people follow Islam. And in Greater Montreal, it's about 8%. Islam is growing really fast in Canada, especially because more people are moving there and families are having more children. This means that more and more Canadians are practicing Islam, making it the religion that's increasing the most in the country. The Pew Research Center predicts that by 2030, around 6.6% of Canada's entire population will be Muslims. Factors contributing to this phenomenon include increased exposure to global cultures, greater access to information about Islam through various media channels, and growing curiosity among the Canadian population about the wider world. As more Muslims become part of Canada's communities, it's becoming easier to find halal food options. Big airports and fancy toilets are now making sure they have food that follow Muslim dietary rules. So, if you're looking to try a famous local spot or want a special meal for a big day, you're covered. The amazing thing about halal is that it cares about treating animals nicely. Even when they're being turned into food, they make sure the process is quick to avoid making animals suffer. Since Canada likes to include everyone and is careful about special diets, there's something called the Halal Monitoring Authority, HMA. They check everything from when an animal is killed to when the food gets to you. And if a company wants to say their food is halal, they have to follow strict rules. The food has to be checked and approved by the HMA before they can put halal on the packaging. To accommodate the spiritual needs of the growing Muslim community, Canada has witnessed a remarkable surge in the number of mosques. The first mosque in Toronto, Jami Mosque, was started 
in 1968 by Bosniaks and Albanian Muslims. The Islamic Foundation of Toronto began in 1969 and offers lots of services, from prayer to education and social help. In 1970, Jami' Abu Bakr Siddiq was built in Scarborough, also serving as an Islamic school. Calgary's first mosque, the Calgary Islamic Center, was established in 1975. The Islamic Cultural Center of Quebec City, supporting Muslims socially and economically, was created in 1985. Even in Newfoundland and Labrador, Masjid and Noah, the first mosque in the city of St. John's, was built in 1990. The Baitul Islam Mosque, north of Toronto, was inaugurated on October 17, 1992, adding to the growing places of worship and community for Muslims in Canada. The Baiturami Mosque in Vancouver was built in 2005 on about 3.75 acres of land, covering 33,419 square feet. Another significant mosque, Peyton Noor, is the largest in Canada and was constructed in Calgary, Alberta in 2008. Currently, there are around 250 mosques and Islamic centers across Canada. In 2019, the Canadian Islamic Broadcasting Network launched as one of the first Islamic internet radio stations. This shows a significant and positive change in the religious landscape of Canada over the years. The increasing number of Muslims is becoming more visible reflecting the country's diversity and the acceptance of different faiths. May Allah keep us all steadfast in this beautiful religion.